Hey guys, welcome to or back to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Amber Scholes or at Amber Runs on Instagram. So right now I'm currently unwell. I am sick. I have been sick for like two days now um, and I'm quite bored. Um, <laughs> because I'm finally out of bed. I was literally sleep like sleeping in my bed all day yesterday, which is not something I do. But I'm finally feeling um, a lot better, and I cleaned my car the other day, so I was like, okay, what is something that I can do right now? And I was like, you guys have been asking me to do a Jeep car tour, so that is what I'm going to do today. It is going to be a Jeep car tour slash what's in an athlete's car, I guess, because... The things I have in my car are really interesting, and I'm not going to lie. I haven't gone through what's in my car, and I know I could live out of my car. I, I don't remember, like, really what's in it right now, but all I know is that, like, the things that are in my car could help me survive if I was in a zombie apocalypse. So, brace yourself Prepare yourself, because I'm about to give you the best car tour you have ever had in your entire life. Let's go. Big Mama Yeti. All right. Okay, so first up, Let's go in the car first. Oh my gosh, there's a moth in my car. Oh, poor guy, it's so hot. It's oh, it's dead. Oh, how did a moth get in my car? Literally, I don't know how this moth got in my car. That's so sad. Okay, so I turned my car on because it's extremely hot here in Florida right now. It's like 90 something degrees. So we're gonna get the air cranking. Um, but in my car, I have a lot of safety things too. Like, you know, I am constantly needing stuff for safety because I like to do fun things. I am out there, you know. I have some rocks. I have my little ducks. I have a seashell up here. I have another duck. I have floss. I always keep floss in my car because I like flossing my teeth. I have some rocks. Um, then I have some flowers. I have this air freshener. So I always keep mace like right here in my car, just for safety, you know. I have my Garmin charger. I always have to make sure my Garmin watch is charged. Um, I always keep like lip gloss in here. I have to keep my car as clean as possible because um, I, I don't know, I just really like having a clean car. It's been a little bit extra sandy recently though, just because I've been going to the beach a lot. I'm gonna show you guys. I have some stuff in here. There's like two compartments. I'm not gonna show you guys like everything that's in there because it's not like that interesting. Okay, so in here right now, I actually have like my states pins and stuff. I also have like my varsity letter pins. Um, I'm not sure why I still have them in here, but I do. And I have some sun balm tinted sunscreen lip balm, which I really love. And it tastes so good. Not taste, oh my god. Well, it does taste pretty good, I'm not gonna lie. It tastes like sunscreen, which I f that's weird. But it's kind of true. Um, I have literally the last of the Blue Be Positive bracelet. This, if you know, you know, I'm wearing one right now. So I'll probably end up giving one of these out to one of you guys soon. But July 1st, purple one comes out. So stay tuned for that. It's the Blue Be Positive one. This one is currently unavailable now. Um, but purple one is coming July 1st, which is super soon love this bracelet this is literally the last one that even i own now let's go into the big compartment so in here i keep my surfboard wax i because i like to go surfing i have two pairs of like sunglasses because florida you know it gets hot and really really sunny this is like icy hot with cb duo it's great um for all the runners, you know, I use this on my shin splints. I use this literally on everything and it feels so good. I have a lacrosse ball. I have a ton of Ron John stickers, like literally way too many Ron John stickers in here. 
Oh my god, it's hot. Oh, I have a big bag of ducks, rubber ducks, in my car, so yeah. And then we have in here, I keep some napkins. This I use to like clean my car out. And then I also keep like deodorant and there's some like snacks and liquid IV. And this side, I keep film for like my Polaroid. We're going into the back of the car. So there's so much storage in here. So right here I have more of my CBD oil stuff. Um, I have a yoga mat. I have this whole bag full of snacks. Um, and it has like literally tuna and stuff in here too. So, keep my journal back here just in case I ever wanna like journal and things like that. I also always keep some sort of like bag in my car. Um, and this one is mostly like a beach bag in case I like ever just wanna like go out to the beach or something. Um, I have some hats because it's hot. My gym bag in here also, which is just this. And I have like a towel and stuff in my car. So in this bag, there's clothes, which I should probably wash, and socks. I'm gonna show you guys what's in my, pretty much my sports bag, because my sports bag is in my car. So I feel like it's only fair that I show you guys everything that's in my car. So in my athletic bag, um, I'm not gonna lie, I have not opened this bag since my state race. So that's concerning, considering it's been sitting in my car for weeks now. Well, on the side, we have some sunscreen. I always keep a lot of sunscreen in my car. Um, I have a lot, actually, sunscreen in the back that I didn't show you guys. I keep a roller. This is the second roller that's in my car. This bag is, like, falling apart. I also... <laughs> That's disgusting! There's like mold. Uh, this was a really good matcha, a matcha drink, <laughs> a protein matcha drink. It's so good, um, but it's definitely weeks old. So we'll just set that aside. I have a lacrosse ball, a, I have socks. <laughs> I have this, which is like something that I use to like stretch my legs. Oh, I've been looking for this. I love these scrunchies. Yeah, I have two in my hair. I have deodorant, more deodorant. This is like a lime flavor and it's like flavor. Oh my God. Frankincense. It's in like a cardboard thing. So it's like better for the environment. There's nothing in this pocket. Thank goodness. I'm praying I don't find any bananas to be honest. Oh, I found another state pen. So that's good because I lost a lot of my state pins. I have a noon hydration, a fork and a spoon. I'm scared to open this, I'm not gonna lie. In this little compartment, I have this old, this old drink. I don't know what that is. I don't, I don't know. So we'll put that with the old drink. Okay, I have another liquid IV, a half eaten little applesauce pouch. Put that with the old stuff. Here's just like literally a ton of different bars. So those always come in clutch when I'm in need. Last but not least, this little zipper. Okay, probably a ton more snacks, I'm not gonna lie. Oh, we got more floss, guys, more floss. Since we have more floss, we know that my dental hygiene is great. Fun gum, which I actually forgot to take before my state's race. I was so sad. I was like on the line, I'm like, oh my gosh. I don't have my run gum in me. I have these Honey Stinger gummies, which I've, I've actually never tried. Oh, guys, guess what? We have more deodorant. <laughs> I have these Honey Stingers, which are actually so good, and these are making me really miss running right now because I'm on my two-week running break in between like my season. This knockoff Bar Bar, which is definitely really like something's wrong with it. Their fork, beet juice, which, um, has made me gag multiple times, came in clutch, and it has helped me a lot. Concentrated beet juice shot. Beat it, yeah. If you guys made it this far into the video, comment. Oh, la, 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 what should we? Old matcha. So if you made it this far in the video, comment old matcha, and I'll know that you're a real one and that you watched this video. <laughs> Mommy runs.
Okay, so in the back of my car, I have a sweatshirt, obviously. I have a ton of reusable bags, as you can see. I literally have not gone through this, so I like don't really know what's in here. I have this whole bin, it's full of shoes. Um, it's all like running shoes. I know you guys are all probably like, Amber, you do not need that many shoes in your car, but you would be surprised the amount of times that I've been like in need of, I don't know, ow. So I have like heels in my car. I have um, like these, these are running shoes. These are my other running shoes. And then just like some trail shoes. I also have a waterproof blanket. Um, and I have like, these types of shoes and like normal type of shoes. I keep most of my shoes in my car just to make sure that my sister doesn't like wear them and stuff too. So I also keep like a jacket, which I don't know why because I probably won't be using it, and some more hats. So under here, I have a hammock. I also keep like hair stuff in here. I usually have like shampoo and conditioner too, just in case. And I actually have a whole survival kit. So this survival kit actually literally has everything that I would need in case of a zombie apocalypse. Maybe I get lost in the woods with my car. I mean, literally the possibilities are endless. This has fire starter. It has like a knife in there. It has a compass, some like water bottle thing. It has like this pen. It has fishing line and like a fishing hook. It has so much stuff just in this little case. So I have that as well with the hammock. I also have another waterproof blanket. Um, so I keep like a lot of useful things in my car, I would say. Have I used some of them? No. Well, one day I might need to use them. Absolutely. You literally never know. And then I also just have like tools in my car. So yeah, I'm out of breath. So my seat in this car, I don't have seat covers, but I have this towel. It's like, it's like, I don't know. It's just like so pretty. Throw a so that is it for today's video, guys. I hope you enjoyed this little car tour plus like what is in my sports bag. I hope you guys have an amazing day and remember to give this video a big old thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and comment down below. Old matcha. Um, I love you guys so much. Stay tuned for next video. Stay positive, stay hype, and live your life on runner's high. Peace out.